Welcome. This video will show you how to fix OBS Studio lag and stutters for recording. Okay, as you can see here, I'm currently using it for recording. So first up, I don't know if you'll be able to see it. I'm just gonna go ahead over to settings right here real quick. Okay, now go ahead and go to settings right here at file, go to settings. Okay, first up for best recording, go ahead and go to video right here. Make sure that the base canvas is set to the resolution that your computer can handle. Okay, to check that, Go over to your uh, home screen right here, right click on a blank space, go ahead and go to display settings. And here scroll down and find display resolution. Whatever is recommended, you're going to use that, okay? 1920 by 1080 right here. I'm gonna open up the uh, OBS Studio, go back to file, settings, and video, okay? 1920 by 1080, as you can see here, it's grayed out because I'm currently recording using the OBS Studio. So, in downscale filters, Make sure that it is set to resolution match, no downscaling required, okay? Output scaled, make sure that it matches, all right? Now, the FPS value right here depends on you, okay? If you're just recording a casual game, just go ahead and leave it to 60 FPS, okay? Or if you have a decent computer, you go ahead and put this one to 120 or 165 or even 240, okay? Once that's done, once this one is set up, go ahead over to output. Make sure that advanced is selected. Now go ahead over to recordings, okay? Copy my settings right here. If you want to save uh, data or uh, drive, change MKV to MP4, all right? Video encoder, if you have an uh, NVIDIA graphics card, make sure to use NVIDIA NVENC HEVC, okay? Which is H265. This is going to use your graphics card, okay? This is the best by far for saving storage and uh, maintaining the high quality, okay? Audio encoder, just leave it as is. Now, rescale output, make sure that it is disabled, okay? Now, scroll down. If you want to copy my settings right here, if you're happy with what you are currently seeing, go ahead and do so. But this one right here, these options of mine or settings of mine do result on a higher video file size, okay? Lossless, keyframe interval, always set this one to two seconds. Multipass mode, full resolution, okay? Two passes. Profile, I use main 10, B frames a zero, as a, if you put B frames right here, it wouldn't work with a last less right control. Okay, you could also use a CBR right here or constant QP. Again, constant QP, if you don't care about your uh, hard drive, okay, you could always use constant QP, set it to 16, and you're good to go. Okay, also lossless. Again, if you're saving uh, storage, you could use a variable bit rate or constant bit rate. Okay. For constant bit rate, I would, uh, I would recommend maybe 15, okay? 15,000 bit rate. For variable, make it to 30, okay? And that's about it. Gonna go ahead and hit on apply, hit on okay. And after that, hit on the record button and the quality will be fixed and the starters will be gone as well. well I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.